Okay, editing Emily here. I'm sitting here on this fine Friday morning trying to edit this vlog and wow, I didn't film an intro at all. So that's what this is. I'm still trying to find my footing as a vlogger, vlogist. I have a lot of flaws that I really need to cut, sort of beat out of myself so that I can vlog properly. First of all, my breath control is really bad, so I just breathe like in the middle of sentences and that just makes the vlog go 10 times slower. This vlog that you're watching was filmed on Wednesday, the 7th of April, and it was the day of the Chicago photo shoot. I am playing Roxy Hart in a production of Chicago with Stage It Productions up in Oriwa um, at Center Stage Theatre. It's running from... Look, I'm not quite sure. Emily, find out, put it here. Thank you. We haven't even started rehearsals yet, but we had a photo shoot. That's what this vlog is. It's sort of my day leading up to that. And then a little bit of footage of kind of behind the scenes of the photo shoot. Hope you're having a good day. Hope you enjoy this vlog. I already said it, but I'm still trying to find my footing. And I am still not sure of my editing style. I'm also editing on iMovie. So like, there's not a whole lot of things I can do. <sighs> Well, woe is me. Here's the vlog. Good morning. I actually woke up relatively easy this morning. I think it's because instead of putting on a TV show and trying to fall asleep to that, I put on a sleepy podcast, which I, I don't know. I think I fell asleep straight away. So good. I think I got a solid eight hours. Good. Good job. And then I started getting ready for the day and I used my steamer because my voice was kind of hurting a little bit, even though I, I should steam every single day, but like I just, I'm a bit lazy. And then I put on my moisturizer and then I did my eyebrows and then I curled my eyelashes and that's my makeup routine for ballet. <laughs> I'm not sure if anyone needed to know any of that, but there you go. And then I did a transition. I mean, it was a bad transition, but I tried. So this is me doing ballet. Do you like it? I don't know if I like it. It's really hard to watch yourself back on camera. I am not a prima ballerina yet. I will get there. I did ballet until I was about 10 and then I quit because I wanted to do soccer. Let, do we see how that turned out? I don't do, I don't do sports now. So that was a bad decision on my part. Anyway, I quit ballet at about 10 years old, didn't do it for eight years. And then when I was 18, I was like, I should probably do this because like, I'm not that good of a dancer. So I should probably try to get back into it. I just really love it, basically. I feel very majestic when I'm floating across the floor, even if I don't look it. This is some of my highlights of, uh, Wednesday's lesson. Yeah, please don't judge me too harshly. Um, I just love it. I also just wanted this to be some sort of encouragement to you that you don't have to be perfect at everything as soon as you begin doing it. <laughs> I started ballet at the level of a two-year-old basically um, and now I'm at about the level of a seven-year-old so we're getting better, we're improving and also just I need you to know that you can start things whenever you want. Um, age doesn't matter. I've had so many people throughout my years on YouTube message me saying, Emily, I'm afraid I didn't get into musical theater early enough. You know, everyone else has been doing it since they were a child, but I'm 18 and I'm too afraid to start. Just start. There is room for everyone. And that sounds sort of cheesy, but there 
there literally is start auditioning for shows in your area you know start doing dance classes like i am there are so many teachers there are so many people willing to help you you just need to start I just finished class and as I was walking out there was this mum and like toddler and the toddler was there for like the toddler ballet thing and she was wearing this cute little tutu and the mum goes looks at me and goes that's a ballerina darling and I was like they think I'm a ballerina I guess I am but like not a good one like not a professional one I don't know back from ballet later today I will start getting ready for the photo shoot um, I'll probably have a shower and wash my hair and then I have to curl it and learn how to underpin it um, to make it look like I've got like a faux lob, long bob kind of thing. And then my makeup. And then me, Ella, Lucy and Prue are driving up to Oriwa and then we're gonna do the photo shoot at Centre Stage. And then I ate a muffin. I ate other things on this day, because of course I did. I just didn't film them. And then I edited my day in the life vlog for three hours. And it's just not good. It's just really not good. And I just wasn't in the right headspace to vlog. I was very out of breath. I couldn't speak properly, and it just, I just it was quite a boring day anyway. Okay, where, where did we leave off? I have been editing all day, and now I'm doing my hair. I have to make a lob. Basically, I've looked up a tutorial, and it said, <laughs> take a small section from the back and braid it, and then I'm going to separate my hair into three parts. One at the back, two on the sides, put a mini hair tie in the bottom, fold them under, and clip them to that thing. We'll see how it goes. Not entirely sure. Ah, uh, I did it, I guess. Remind me to never cut my hair like this. I think it's interesting. The front looks okay the back is very questionable but we're taking photos so i doubt i'm gonna be like you know okay <laughs> lighting is a bit weird but makeup and hair done i'm not the best at makeup but i, I figured it out there we are driving drive 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 um i went to ella's house and then from ella's house we went and picked up lucy and prue and then we drove Hi vlog. Oh. <laughs> uh, hi there. Hello. We're, we're driving. Yeah, yeah. Yay. And then we got to the theatre and I got changed straight away and this is the first costume. And then I sat in the audience and watched while the ensemble did their photos. And oh my god, how cool does it look? The 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 the, 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 the stage, the lighting, the smoke, everything. Oh my god, I was so blown away. These photos are gonna be amazing. And I learned more about what's actually happening in the show, like what we're doing set wise. And I am so excited for you to see it. You see, the thing is, my best attribute right now is my bicep. <laughs> And I would like to just pose like this or something. <laughs> And then this is me taking photos and um, filming and stuff. And obviously I was very stressed out. I We had to do the Charleston. I don't know if I can do that. And then we wrapped and it was time to go home. And I am so excited to see these photos and videos and stuff. Oh my God. And then when I finally got home, I had the best vegetarian sausage rolls I've ever had in my entire life. I'm back home now. I'm halfway through taking off my makeup and I just realized I didn't sign off. Good night. Sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. If you like this video, <laughs> give it a thumbs up and maybe a comment if you feel like it. Cool, thank you, goodbye. <laughs>